Queen Elizabeth II has been told to slow down after testing positive for coronavirus as Britain's fear for her health. The monarch, 95, is experiencing mild cold-like symptoms but expects to carry out light duties this week. Buckingham Palace said in a statement, Buckingham Palace confirmed that the Queen has today tested positive for Covid. Her Majesty is experiencing mild cold-like symptoms but expects to continue light duties at Windsor over the coming week. She will continue to receive medical attention and will follow all the appropriate guidelines. Now, Britons have urged the Queen to rest and many have sent her good wishes and speedy recovery. One Twitter user, Nina Kettle, wrote, sending good vibes that the Queen does not have too bad symptoms and recovers quickly. Thomas Downey added, we can only hope that she gets through this. It only goes to prove that no one is immune from catching the virus. Mona wrote, get well soon, your majesty. With Julie saying, take the week off love. Another said, just rest mom. And Bryn Devlin commented, she does not need any stress. I wish her well and really hope she recovers quickly. Betsy Tarr wrote, it did seem inevitable. I'm glad Hum has a mild form, but any illness at her age is not to be taken lightly. Wishing him a speedy recovery. Another Twitter user, known as Hello My Name is Chris, added, hope she pulls through. Speedy recovery HR Queen Elizabeth. Your Philip will be looking over you. Bert Van Winkle tweeted, not a royalist by any stretch of the imagination but wish her a speedy recovery, as with all the other 1000s of sufferers. Chaucer commented, oh that's really sad and shows that lifting all restrictions is a bad idea at this time. Hopefully it will be mild and she is strong enough to fight it off. Her Majesty's positive test comes after the Queen had been in direct contact with Prince Charles the week he had the virus. She is believed to have spent time with the Prince of Wales on February 8 when he hosted an investiture at Windsor Castle. A few days later he tested positive but made a quick recovery. Clarence House confirmed on Monday that Camilla had also tested positive for coronavirus.